Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel or welcome if you are new. I'm Eliantra and welcome back to another CC showcase. I don't think I posted one last month. I'm sorry. I got so busy with Sims 4 werewolves, but we're back. We have another monthly CC haul. It's been a while since the last one, so there was a lot to download. I found some really good items. So like always, all the links are gonna be in the description box in the same order that I am showcasing the CC. Everything here is Max's match. And if you like my CC videos, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you're new here. I post a lot of CC content. I usually post these videos with brand new CC every single month. So hopefully I'll have another one up in another month or so, unless Sims 4 high school years gets me super busy. But yeah, let's get started. We're using Vanessa today as our CC model. This is actually not the first outfit. This is, we're gonna start from here. I like to show the hairs in blonde. I think you can see the texture quite clearly that way. Surprisingly, there were only 15 hairs that I was able to find, which is crazy because it's been so long since the last CC haul that I did. But I love these 15 hairs and I have a lot of other CC to show you guys. So the first hair is this Alexa hair from Enrique. Just a simple ponytail, but it's really, really pretty. I liked it in a darker color as well. And the next one also from Enrique is this Susie hair, another ponytail. This one has this like side bang thing going on. Then we have this Amy hair, which is like really simple, but really cute, super Max's match. Maybe we can do like this color. Then we have this Kirsty hair, which is so cute. This is the one she had on earlier. I love it. And the headband you can add on. Does it originally? Yeah, it has a black headband. You can change the color in the hats category if you download a separate file. For some reason though, I can't get nails to show up with this. Like, nails don't work. Do they have regular nails? No. This headband, for some reason, it makes the nails not work, so just beware of that. Then we have two hairs from Clumsy Alien. First up is this Mandy hair. It's like a wolf cut, probably an edit from one of the werewolf hairs. And then also this one, which is the Frankie hair. Really cute, really nice. Then moving on, we have this Leah hair from Austin. We have some hair clips as well on one side. Bit of a shorter hairstyle. The hair clips can be added from the hats category. And then also from Austin, we have this Jada hair, which is stunning. This one actually comes with an ombre that you can add on, as you can see. I think it's quite pretty. Also the hair clips, again, in the hats category if you want those. The ombre is in face paint, I believe. Yeah, and we have all the usual colors, but you can also, you know, use these sliders to change the color. So you can basically make any color you want. So that's really cool. Then the next hair is this Nessie hair, an edit from one of the werewolf hairs. I think this turned out really cute. Then we have this Mary hair. Look how much hair there is. I'm obsessed with this. Look at it in like a darker color. I love the braids in the front as well. Then we have this Daisy hair, which is very, very cute. I think another edit from werewolves. Whenever a new pack comes out, a lot of new meshes obviously come out as well from all the new items. And then CC creators love using those to make new items. I did just notice that like, can you see here? Like, there's like a weird gap there where obviously there shouldn't be a gap. So if that bothers you, just keep that in mind. But I thought it was a really, really nice hair. I really liked it in darker colors as well. Then we have this Nima hair from Sims Trouble. The next few hairs are from Sims Trouble. One of my favorite hair creators. This one's really, really cute. And the next one is the Stevie hair. Look how cool this is. You can also get this for masculine sims and in the preview it looked really good obsessed with that and then we also have the Mar marcia marcia hair marcia oh my god this one also has like weird shading um up here you can't really tell in the darker colors that it's there not really at all but then when you do the blonde 
like there's something there and maybe here as well. I don't think it's any of my other CC. It could be something not working with it, like a skin detail, but I did try and take things off. But a really cute, like kind of a curly wavy hairstyle. And then the last hair we have is this Lexi hair. Look, it has these colored braids in the front. You can change the color of those, otherwise it's a straight long hairstyle. Really like this in a darker color as well, I think. This is gonna be in, yeah, if this is in accessories, you can change the color of the braids and we have regular EA colors and then some extra colors in here as well. I matched it to her dress, so I thought that was cute. Then I do have one new set of eyebrows from Twisted Cat. I've downloaded eyebrows from them before and I think they're really good and they're super maxis match. So this is the first pair, which I love. I believe these ones also come from the set. Maybe I would shape them a little bit. And then these ones as well, if you're looking for some new maxis match eyebrows, definitely recommend. But then moving on to makeup, we have this wings set from Twisted Cat. This is the eyeshadow. Can you see there's like a different colored wing? She has really big eyelashes, so it might be a little bit hard to see. This is really cool. I like this a lot. It also comes with this lip gloss. Um, I toned it down a little bit because I couldn't really find a color that I thought went with her skin tone and this outfit, but it's really, really cute. Here are some of the swatches. I like how subtle the shine is. It's kind of Max's match still. So I thought that was really, really cute. We also have the Pyrite makeup set. So for this one, we have an eyeshadow, which is this one, bunch of different colors. And then in blush, we have this, the option to add these like foily leaf looking things. So they come in gold, then like pink, silver, and bronzy colors and there's like four different options so that one this one and then we have this one which is stunning and this one i thought this was really really cool and the set also comes with a lipstick i'm using this one so all these swatches come with like matte and then glossy colors or like options so i love the gloss as well it's quite strong for some of these but this is a really really pretty lipstick then from Cryptic Sim, we also have a new eyeshadow palette. It's the Whistler palette. Looks like this. I'll show some of the uh, more vibrant colors. It's quite a big area. Like you can see even here on the catalog picture. Oh my God, I love that color. Actually, it's quite subtle. Really nice, really cool. I like this a lot. And then we also have an eyeliner, the Kai eyeliner. Can you even see it? Okay, I'm using a brown color. I'll show it in like white. It's quite subtle, but you can see it there. And then we do have a lot of colors to play with. I thought that was really pretty. Then moving on to accessories. First, I wanna show you guys these 3D lashes from Miko. So I have a lot of CC from Miko, but I've never downloaded lashes from them. But these look really nice and these are I downloaded the version that's in the glasses category. I think most of my lashes are in here, but there were other options as well. They come in a bunch of different colors. I thought these were really nice. And then moving on to earrings and necklaces. I have a lot of CC here from Christopher067 and all of this is downloaded from The Sims Resource, just so you know. I think The Sims Resource is okay. Not as good as like Tumblr, Patreon, that kind of stuff, because it takes a bit longer to download from there. But just so you guys know, so we're starting off with the latte set. So we have the matching earrings and necklace, cute layered necklace. We have the heart. Obviously, these come in a million colors, like literally. There are so many color options here. It's basically endless. <laughs> then we have the angel set. So we have these cute, like almost like little daisy earrings. And then this like pearl necklace with a daisy in the middle, really, really pretty. They come in different metallics. Then we have the majesty set. So we have the earrings, which I like. I have similar earrings in real life, so I have to get these. And then this is the necklace, matching necklace. Another layered, nice necklace. I'm sure I will be using that a lot. Then we have the fate set as well. So again, matching earrings and necklace heart earrings. Really love this necklace. It's super cute. I'm obsessed with it. 
Then moving on, we have these, no, we have these Cleo earrings. Thought they were quite nice and simple, but unique. And we also have this necklace, which is the Perla necklace. I love it, honestly, obsessed with it. Then moving on, we have the Pavillon set, if I said that right. So we have these like butterfly earrings, so pretty. And then also a layer necklace with a butterfly as well. So another matching set. Then we have this Naya necklace that looks like this, comes in metallics, really pretty, really nice quality. We also have the lovesick necklace with a little heart pendant. Thought that was so cute. And then we have the Ava necklace which is this one, a bit bigger and very Max's match. Oh, we also have these floral earrings. Um, it's a set of two. This is the first pair, so pretty. There's a bunch of different colors and they're so Max's match. And then here was the other one, it's like a tulip, can you see it? And it comes in a bunch of colors as well. I thought that was so pretty. And then lastly up here, we have this Kayla necklace, another layered necklace but they're not like perfectly aligned, which I kind of like. The texture is like a tiny bit alpha, but honestly, I don't mind. I think this is a really cute set. We also have new nails from Jolie Bean. So we have new fingernails. So I had these ones before, and then now we have a glossy version of these, and they come in the same colors. And then we also have like a different shape. Can you tell it's a bit of a different shape? And we have the same color palette. And then I had to get the toenails as well, because I didn't have any CC toenails, and they have the huge color palette as well. We also have these nails, which are just called fringe nails. And these ones are crazy, there's a lot of um really cool patterns in here i haven't even seen all of these yeah these are cool we also have this jesse waist chain so i actually have two waist chains in this video i'm loving them um these butterflies and everything silver is part of the pants but it's this thing in the middle i feel like i could have found a better outfit to show this with but it comes in a bunch of different colors and I think that's stunning. I can't wait to style some outfits with that. And the other waist chain that I have is this flower waist chain from Miko, I think. Look how pretty. I think it would look cute on with like a crop top or something like on your bare skin as well, but I didn't I didn't have an outfit ready for that, so I'm just showing it with this dress. I love it. Then moving on to clothing, starting with tops, we have this Lori sweater from Scentaint. Huge color palette as always. I just thought it was really, really cute. And then we also have this ocean top. I love the sunglasses there. I think you can download this without the sunglasses as well, but I thought that was really creative. And this color palette is huge. This is from like a little pack. The shorts are from the same pack. I'll show you guys those later. Then we have the Ashley top. Again, it's from a pack. The skirt comes with it, but this is cute. So we have like basic swatches. And then we also have some really cute patterns in here. Kind of obsessed with it. And then we have like some textured ones. I thought that was really, really cute. And then we have this spillways top. This one is like similar to the one I just showed you guys. It's giving me a tiny bit of alpha vibes. The solid swatches are totally Max's match, as you can see. Oh my god. That like matched her headband and everything. But then we do have like this pattern going on and it's a little bit alpha. But honestly, like in the green, for example, I don't mind. I think that's a really cute outfit. Then we have this candy sugar pop top. So it's one shoulder, if you can tell. We have a little bow going on here. We have a bunch of basic swatches. And then we also have some really, really nice patterns in here again from Trilica. I love that. Then we have this ride or die, no, ride or tie top. So basically this is like the werewolf's dress, but they cut it and made it into a top instead. But it comes with the like hoodie flannel wrapped around your waist. And then we have like a bunch of colors in here. I thought that was really nice. I'm definitely gonna use that. I love that dress from werewolves. Then this is the medley top. Looks like this. Um, You can change the color of the top under it separately. So here are some of the swatches that it comes in. And then if we go into gloves, we have a separate file in here and then you can change the color 
off the top as well, which I think is really nice. Then the next up we have is this lace crop top from Miko. This is beautiful. I'm obsessed with this. It comes in some really nice pastel swatches, then in some reds, and then we have black and white. I thought it was super pretty. And then lastly in tops, we have this Regina top that looks like this. This comes with a dress as well. I like it. We have a bunch of solid swatches and then some of these patterns down here which I thought were pretty. And then moving on to bottoms, we have this skirt which is the first one under the bottoms category down below in the description box. I don't know how to say this name. Sioxi? Sioxi? Like honestly, I, I give up but it's a low-waisted mini skirt and it has this belt um situation going on a couple patterns as well the belt is like a tiny bit 3d it's not fully it's not like a chunky belt but that's cool it comes from the same post as the top then we have these ocean shorts again they come with this top really high-waisted and a bunch of denim swatches in here i thought those were cute then we have the jade skirt so a nice little denim skirt i love the belt with the heart on it as well and then we have a bunch of colors even some bright ones in here i thought that was kind of nice then we have these griftwood jeans which i love i love that they're high-waisted i kind of love this pattern they're high-waisted but they're still like kind of loose and then there's a bunch of colors in here kind of obsessed with these to be honest then we have the love dive shorts really nice maxis match shorts from triliga they come in a bunch of colors so we have like a bunch of blues and then other colors as well and then some like gradient swatches and then these bows on the side those you can add on from the ring category so originally the shorts don't have them and then there's a bunch of colors for the bows as well like look how cute that is then we have these lotus shorts which are kind of like jogger shorts does that make any sense but i like that they're high-waisted and there's a lot of colors and there's even some patterns in here that are kind of fun i thought these were cool i don't think i have anything like this for feminine sims and then we also have these bloom shorts as well from the same creator really nice super high-waisted so many colors as well and a couple of patterns which are really really pretty so i like those then we have these pop pants from trilica they have butterflies and then like yeah they have this belt so maybe i should take this off so you can see they have this belt with like 3d butterflies like that's really cool it's like a tiny bit alpha but also at the same time it's absolutely stunning so i'm in love with it we also have these nicole jeans which look like this another heart belt and then these ones have like basic swatches and then also some extra swatches there's quite a few in here so i thought those were really really nice and then lastly in bottoms we have this cargo mini skirt so a low-waisted super super short mini skirt but it's a denim skirt comes in a load of colors as well moving on to a full body we have the regina dress so we have this as a top and now here it is as a dress i actually quite love it we do have the same patterns for this as well i think it's really pretty the next dress we have is this lori sweater dress look how flattering this is like honestly obsessed with this i love the texture as well we have the scented color palette that we usually get which i love also from scented we have this jasmine tea dress we have the bell going on again and then it's kind of like ripped at the bottom with the same color palette and a couple of like graphic tea versions down here i thought that was really nice then we have this absolutely stunning dress. This is the Paris dress. I don't usually like sequins as something like super bling bling, but for some reason I'm obsessed with this dress. Like look at all of these beautiful swatches. I cannot wait to use this dress. It's so pretty. Then we have the Beatrice dress also from Scentite. Looks like this. I like this one a lot. 
same big color palette but we gotta match it to her hair <laughs> then we have this shannon dress again look how flattering this is and again the texture is everything same color palette i love that dress and then we have this let it be me dress so this one actually you can add these gloves in separately so this is the dress without them look how stunning would be great for prom for example or even as your wedding dress i do think this comes in white as well but here it is with the gloves so these are obviously in the gloves category if you want those do we have yeah we do have a white color and we have a lot of other colors as well and it's a little bit shiny absolutely beautiful then we have this this is called like Kaisarion dress. I don't know how to say that. Uh, it's a little bit different, a little bit alpha, but I don't really usually show stuff like this. So I wanted to include it because I found it and I like the swatches. In some of them, this dress on top, the pattern looks like quite alpha, but in others, I think it passes as Max's match and I thought it was kind of cool. Then we also have the vintage summer dress look how cute and pretty and there's so much lace and everything going on comes in five pastels and then in black as well and then lastly we have this t-shirt dress from miko this one comes in stunning patterns as you can see we have the buttons in the front and then we also have like basic swatches stunning Okay, lastly, we have the shoes category. I have a bunch of shoes from this creator again, Gia's. They make so many shoes. I can't download them all because honestly, there's so many. So I kind of pick and choose now. So this is like part of a collection. I think I only downloaded two shoes out of four. So definitely check out the whole collection and decide for yourself. But the first collection is the vacation collection and I have these flats. Um, huge color palette and also these shoes are from the same collection these boots again a huge color palette i thought these were kind of unique then we have these strawberry slippers these ones come on their own look how cute i love them they have a bunch of colors as well then the next collection is the retro collection so i downloaded three shoes from this um this is the first pair of shoes really nice huge color palette we also have these i love these like hippie boots completely obsessed with them i love the flowers and then these are also from the collection these are unique as well i don't have anything else like this with the heels too then we have the canvas sneakers these are like converse shoes and um, these ones come in a lot of different like patterns which i thought were really really nice there's a lot in here i thought those were really cool we also have the crystal collection so again i downloaded three shoes from the crystal collection first up are these heels those are like hearts on the straps absolutely stunning i'll show a couple of colors from the crystal collection as well we have these boots look at them with like diamonds almost on the side I thought these were really, really pretty. And then, oh my God, you're not ready to see these. Look at these. Absolutely stunning pearl details. Like these are beautiful. Then we also have the Chili collection up next. I downloaded these trainers from it. Really nice Maxis Match trainers. We also have these, these ones. Oh my God, these stunning. I want to call them boots, but they're not. They're like heels, but then the laces or whatever go all the way up like absolutely beautiful huge color palette definitely recommend and then i have two more pairs of shoes these are both from trulica we have the moonlight sneakers they actually look like this there's a bunch of different colors they're chunky really nice and then we have the teddy bear slippers oh my god these are adorable look at the little bear faces honestly i'm obsessed Okay, so that's it for this month's CC Showcase. I hope you guys found something new that you liked. My Tumblr is always linked down below. That is where I will reblog everything even before I post the video. So if you want to follow that, go ahead and you'll see everything even before the video comes out. But yeah, all the other links are in the description as well. Give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you like my CC Showcases, subscribe if you're new here. I can't wait for Sims for High School Years content 
weekend to start soon, hopefully. So make sure you have my notifications turned on. And that's all for me today. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.